then i asked that uh, candidate master guy same for him i'm not kidding even he was not able to solve and even he was not able to solve the tree based problems hello everyone how's it going so i just wanted to make this video what happened is that yesterday two of my friends who were learning programming from me appeared for infosys specialist programmer coding test so infosys has a designation of a specialist programmer which has a cdc of around 9 lakhs per annum so both of these people were beginners and i just taught them c++ so they appeared for the coding test of infosys which was for around 3 hours and both of them later came to me shared their experience and shared the problems that they had so the first guy came to me and he had three problems in 3 hours the first problem was a geometry based problem which was which was not easy it was not difficult either it was a medium level problem and it had points and then we had to find some point it was something like that and like i said it was medium i was able to uh, find a solution to it within 20 25 minutes along with code then he told me about the second problem that he had which was a dynamic programming problem okay so the second problem was a dynamic programming problem which was again not easy it was a medium level problem and again i was able to come uh, up with a solution within i would say 30 to 40 minutes then he told me about the third problem he told me the third problem which was a tree based problem and it was difficult it was not easy it was not medium it was pretty difficult okay and so at that point i was pretty surprised because this was infosys coding test which was supposed to be easy because you hear these companies and you think that their coding test would be easy and even though the cdc is 9 lakhs the difficulty of the coding test was like uh, above that you know the cdc that they were offering that's what i felt so that was okay then the second person came to me and he told me about the problems he had so he had a first problem which was a mathematical problem and it was a pretty difficult problem like i was not able to figure out any solution for that problem like i was not able to wrap my head around a solution for that problem and then the second problem was again a dynamic programming problem which was again not easy it was again i would say from medium to difficult it was between a medium to a difficult level problem and then again the third problem was i guess dp on trees and it was again pretty difficult so i was thinking that maybe because i'm out of practice or it was something like that but i was still surprised that the level of difficulty is so damn high so i thought maybe i should get some second opinion so i have some friends one of my friend is a master on code forces is an extremely good computer programmer and uh, i think he is in top 100 in india and another one of my friend is a candidate master okay on code forces so i asked both of them and uh, so i asked the first guy who is a master and even he was not able to solve the mathematical problem by himself so even he was not able to solve even he was not able to figure out a solution for that problem then i asked that uh, candidate master guy same for him i'm not kidding even he was not able to solve and even he was not able to solve the tree based problem so the master solved the tree based problem and the candidate master that uh, was my friend was not able to solve the tree based problem so at this point i'm very surprised i did not know of this and i get it the cdc is 9 lakhs which is decent i mean it's not too high and the level of the difficult uh, the level of difficulty of the of the problems of the coding round is so damn high like i was so surprised so my question is this suppose that a person is able to solve all three problems right and they so for that they have to be very good at either computer programming or problem solving so if someone is able to solve all the problems of that round then why would they join infosys which is only offering 9 lakhs why wouldn't they join all those great companies which offers 40 lakhs 50 lakhs because they also have a difficult coding round right even they have difficult dsa uh, they require high level of dsa knowledge and likewise for infosys even they require high level of dsa knowledge they require high level computer programming skills but the cdc the cdc that they are offering is really not up to the mark so that's what and i really do have no idea what to say at first i thought maybe it's me i'm out of practice but then i got second opinion and whoever i asked they said that it is difficult and i knew it was supposed to be difficult i knew people told me before that infosys has a really difficult coding test but i didn't expect it to be expected to be this difficult so let me tell you this let me give you a warning or a head start so if you are appearing for infosys specialist programmer then do know that the coding test is not going to be easy especially if it was off campus so this was off campus i should mention that but yeah if you are appearing for infosys then you should be good with your computer programming skill and your dsa skills and as for infosys i really feel that they should like increase their compensation for the person because the person who is able to clear that round is definitely a great computer programmer and definitely has mad level skills So that's it guys just wanted to share this with you because I was very surprised about all this so that's all